including two adorable puppies that we are gonna, I think, give away to good, loving homes. And so what do we actually learn from plot when we do this? Where this turn down actually happens gives you an idea of the star formation rate of the galaxy or stellar populations. There we go. Let's see what's in the swag bag. Here at AAS 233, day zero, so the first day. Today, my thoughts are about homecoming. Okay, so I live in Seattle, so the idea of homecoming is pretty obvious here. Uh, but this meeting is a, a sense of homecoming. These are where most of my friends, professionally and personally, uh, can be found each year. Uh, this is like my 12th winter AAS and my 15th AAS period. I've been going to these meetings for a while, so this is part of my work, part of my personal life now. For so many of us, we travel uh, we move away, we only spend a few years at a given institution, so the people you make friends with, the people you make relationships with, they move on, they move away. And it's only meetings like this that you get to see them. So I'm thinking a lot about homecoming, I'm thinking about uh, belonging, and what it means to be part of this group, and part of this profession. Also, an ancillary benefit so far, because I've been shooting this vlog for a year, I just got my name tag and I've already had two students approach me saying they've watched my videos and they wanted to meet me. So, thank you the people who have been watching this, and thank you to people who are coming and seeking me out because I am holding this giant camera. And also, this thing's heavier than I remember. Hi, I'm Jacob Palawa. I'm a junior at Colgate University, and I studied the low surface brightness outskirts of galaxies and hopes of understanding inside-out disk formation theory. Hi, my name is Katie Chapman. I'm a senior from Colgate University, and I modeled the gamma emission of the massive star cluster Western 1 to try to learn about its ability to accelerate cosmic rays. <laughs> As a bonus, the Seattle meeting was actually my first AAS meeting, so it's good to be back in the convention center. I don't come down here very often. Okay, one of my favorite things about the Seattle Convention Center is the way they've built it sort of vertically. So you have this lookout, which is bad for my fear of heights, but is fun to watch. That's going to be super cool. I'm looking forward to that. I know those guys. All right, so it's like mid-afternoon. So I got here this morning around 10 o'clock and I sat in the NSF Symposium. So the talks today I went to were part of the NSF Postdoc Fellowship Symposium. That's the postdoc that I had for the last three years. So it's still fun to go and like hang out, talk to the new fellows. What makes that fellowship and that symposium special is that they talk both about the research that the fellows are doing and also the broader impacts, outreach projects or education things they're building. It's really neat. Uh, and then I went and got my badge. The undergrad reception's in about an hour, so I gotta go back to my car and pick up the box of the UW uh, stuff. The plan today is I gotta finish a talk that I'm giving tomorrow, uh, so I have a few more slides to make, and uh, then go to the opening reception. So that'll be fun. Okay, time for the undergrad reception. I have a box of awesome stuff, including two adorable puppies that we are gonna, I think, give away to good, loving homes. Also, I'm super hungry, and all I have is a smashed granola bar in my backpack, so I hope there's food. I said this last year at the undergrad reception. This is, the undergrad reception and the opening reception are good places to get food, but only if you're like ambitious and get in line. So hopefully this year I fare a little better because I'm super hungry. Did not eat enough today. Plus like, you know, this whole thing takes energy. How are you? Boulder, New Mexico, all good schools, but not my school. Here we go. Right behind here, we're doing the undergrad 
table, meet and greet. We're meeting lots of cool students who are interested in UW as a grad program. It's going well. And I got a few snacks. Kepler Geo Office. Kepler Geo Office. It's our first time on camera, obviously. They're probably going to visit the department on TV around. Maybe I'll stop by. I think it means it's time to leave. Well, undergrad reception done. That was uh, that was a long hour and a half. My voice is very raw now. I need some water and I need a snack. I need a snack real bad. Okay, the opening reception. There's no place like home. Hey man. Hey buddy. Wow. How you been? Sebastian. Hey. Thank you for the cookies, dude. I appreciate that. Hope Sarah likes them. She will. <laughs> Coffee at 8 p.m. Perfect. What could go wrong? All right, day zero is over. Undergrad reception, opening reception, four cups of coffee, and I got my talk ready for tomorrow, so that's good. A day of, uh, of homecoming, friends. Hi, friend. Am I in the shot? That's good. <laughs> and I'm recording. This is good. Tomorrow, full day of science. I don't get to be a tourist in my own city very much. It's very pretty. See you tomorrow.